As a kid, they tell you not to talk to strangers. But what about social media? Does that count? How do you know who's really who? My dad always told me beautiful women can be dangerous. I wonder if you look this beautiful in person. Who am I kidding? I'm sorry. It's okay. Jennifer? Yeah. Have we met? No, I saw your profile on my social media. <laughs> Are you stalking me? No, unless you want me to. <laughs> well, you know my name. What's yours? Tony Lee. Tony. Tony the stalker. <laughs> Even comical Maybe hard to find Drive you out of your mind A mess of disaster A moment of truth And totally random But it makes us who we are Don't judge. Technically, it was a second date. Maybe we should get a dog together. <laughs> like a small dog or a big dog? Any. I love <laughs> dogs. My father never let me have one, said it would make me weak. Hmm. Well, I think we should get a dog. Really? Mm-hmm. Like a big, giant, fluffy husky. It's gonna <laughs> shed all over you and all over your stuff. So other people will smell you and uh, uh, <laughs> be like, you smell like dogs. You know what? <laughs> that sounds great. Mm -hmm. mm. What are you doing? Just a momento. Me. You. Don't Us. post it. Why? My friends are going to be so jealous. I said don't. Hey, it's just a photo. If you like me, don't post anything. I'm not a trophy. Okay. You got it. Okay. I'm starting to really, really <laughs> like you. Really? Mm-hmm. Then show me. But the sun's out. Yeah. So at least it's not raining. Hey, you wanna try that Thai place with me tomorrow night? Sounds great. Wait. Hmm? I'm sorry, I can't. My dad's in town. Oh. Why don't you invite him to join us? I don't know. He's in town for some big important meeting and he's usually super busy. Well, he's still gotta eat, right? I'd like to meet him. I don't know if that's a good idea. Why not? You think he wouldn't like me or something? Of course not. He's just... He doesn't usually like my taste in girls. And things can get... uncomfortable. Are you ashamed of me or something? No. You don't know my dad. He doesn't like anybody. But... You would be the closest to the type of girl that he would like. What does that mean? Are you playing me? Of course I'm not playing you. Wait. I'll introduce you to him tomorrow. Okay. You better not be playing me. I hate players. Jen. Come here. You don't understand my father. He doesn't trust 
anyone. Do you trust me? Of course I do. You're my Jen. I'm sorry. His meetings usually run late. It's kind of a big deal. It's okay. Relax. Why are you so nervous? You're <laughs> just your dad. I spent most of my time in private boarding schools. Hardly knew him growing up. What about your mom? I don't get to see her much since they divorced. He made sure to keep her far away from me. Mm. What about your parents? Well, pretty standard, boring Asian parents. Mom was an accountant, dad was an engineer. I became an accountant because it's easy, safe. That's pretty boring, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just call me boring? You weren't complaining about me being boring last night. Definitely not. <laughs> Dad, this is Jennifer. Hi, Mr. Lee. Call me Dennis. Very beautiful. Thank you. Jennifer, what do you do? I'm an accountant. Oh, yeah? Yes. Where? I work for one of the big four. And smart, too. Not at all like the trashy girls Tony normally dates. I wonder, what do you see in him? Dad, stop being embarrassing. Oh, Tony is very sweet and thoughtful. And Excuse me. I got a few things to finish before we go out to eat. Hey, uh, do I have to do everything myself? If this happens again, you're fired, you understand? I gotta go downstairs. You wait out there. Just be a minute. Okay, but hurry. I'm sure Jennifer's hungry. She's so skinny. She'll be fine. That was so embarrassing. It's okay. I'm so sorry. Don't worry about it. I'm here for you. You want some water? Yeah, sure. Thank you for understanding. Of course. <laughs> Feeling kind of busy. Jennifer? Jen? Those people can't do anything right. Make me wait so long. You ready? Where's Jennifer? I don't know. Did she go to the bathroom? She just disappeared. It's too skinny anyway. It's not funny. You probably scare her off. The number you dialed is not what?
I searched Google, Bing, DuckDuckGo, even Yahoo. It was like some big eraser had come and scrubbed away every trace of her. Did I imagine her? Was I going crazy or becoming delusional? Even the photo of us together on my phone was gone. Yes, Dad? What are you talking about? I'll be right down. Somebody hacked into my computer. All the company files have been compromised. Sensitive information about our deals has been leaked to the press. What does that mean? I'm leaving for Hong Kong. The board of directors are holding an emergency meeting right now. They're gonna vote to kick me out of my own company to save it. Even that might not be enough. Tony, we're ruined. Oh my God. What do you know about Jennifer? How'd you meet her? We just met at some tea house. It was funny, I saw her profile on social media the day before we met. And been dating for a few weeks. Why are you asking? Jennifer was the last one in the room with my computer before it got hacked. Dad, what are you saying? You got a lot to learn, son. She disappeared right after that. A smart woman like that can be dangerous. Just like your mother. Tony, you got played. Why would she be after me? She wasn't after you. She used you to get to me. Get out. Maybe my dad was right. I got played. But I need to know for sure. What if she was in some kind of trouble? Maybe she did it against her will. Tried my hand at hacker sites, underground forum sites, looking for anyone who looked like her. Nothing. Maybe I could go to the police. No, that wouldn't do any good. She was probably using a fake name, fake account. Fake name, fake account. Maybe if I use a fake account, I could find her. Apply a bit of Photoshop, I'll become Johnny Tong. My apartment had a security camera, scrubbed clean as well. Wait, there's a cached thumbnail in the trash. Got you. Now to use Google image search. Bingo. Huh? Jennifer! Are you talking to me? Yes, Jennifer, I know it's you. Wait your turn. If you're in some trouble, I can do whatever I can to help. I miss you. You're pretty feisty for a sub. A what? A submissive. Please, tell me. Did you hack into my dad's computer? This is a members only club. You gotta go. Wait. Get him down, on your knees. In here, you respect me or you get punished. Did you use me? Shut up. Did you? Shut up. <laughs> You're so pathetic. You think some perfect woman just shows up in your life and solve all your mommy and daddy issues? I trusted you. 
And you destroyed my dad's life. My life! Don't you dare talk of that fucking little shit! His company's built on blood. Even though he tried to protect you, your hands are soaked in it. What are you talking about? Let me teach you a lesson. Where do you think your money came from? Family he destroyed? People he cheated? Parents he killed? Like Jennifer's! You might pretend to be someone else. But I know you still have feelings for me. <gasps> I can never feel anything for you. You mean nothing to me. Nothing at all. No. That's not good enough. I want you to look me in my eyes and tell me you don't love me. Then listen up. Karma is a bitch called Jennifer. You better pray that God forgives you, because I won't. Excuse you. Gemma T. Dominatrix. Ron. Joseph Ron. Joseph. Now this is funny because I was just looking at your social media profile earlier today. And well, here you are. In the flesh. Are you stalking me? Someone needs a good spanking. 